but I'm actually traveling to another city for work soon and I'll be going for four days to Adelaide for kind of like a conference event as part of my normal full-time job. I'm only going for four days so I won't really need to pack a whole bunch of stuff but just enough to have a new outfit every day and then just a few things that I can wear for dinners and things like that. So I thought I would show you a method that really helped me out when I was packing for this trip and something that just helped me figure out which outfits I want to take and also how to make sure I can wear all the items with each other and make new outfits as well. There's this kind of theory that I know that it's been around for a while but I have also seen it on TikTok there's been a few creators that have created content around this and it is the 333 method. I know that Rachel Speed has been using it and I've also seen it on YouTube as well. If you want I'll also link some videos or information or links that I've been kind of looking at to get inspired down below so if you're interested you can kind of keep exploring the topic. Basically the 333 method is having three tops, three bottoms and three shoes or accessories as well. So, so the idea is mainly to be able to create a bunch of different outfits with these items and that can all be interchanged to create new looks as well and that way you don't have to kind of overpack as well. And also this is really useful when you don't really need a lot of outfits, you're only going for a really short trip. If you're going on a longer trip there is maybe other methods that you can use and I guess the idea is also on a longer trip you might want to have a washing machine if you can't wear the same top a few times in a row. Because I'm only going for four days and I only really need three days worth of outfits that I kind of work wear, I found it a lot easier to narrow down the outfits and items I wanted to take. For my trip I only really needed work wear kind of items and a little bit more on the casual side anyway so I'm allowed to wear jeans and sneakers and things like that. I'll go through the items that I wanted to bring and then I'll also show you some of the outfits that I can kind of put together and how many outfits I can create with just these items. For my tops I decided to bring a black t-shirt. This one is from Uniqlo. It's very versatile and I love this top. I like the way it fits and it's pretty easy to mix and match with a whole bunch of different bottoms as well. The next top I have is this black long sleeve top and it's kind of like a ribbed material. I like the way it fits and it kind of feels a bit more formal top and on the sleeve it's got a bit of a detail as well which makes it quite nice and really put together as well. The last top that I wanted to bring is this striped shirt. It is a men's shirt that I thrifted but I like the way it fits and it is quite oversized so you can wear it out or you can kind of also tuck it in as well. So this one as well. So for my bottoms I decided to bring these black trousers from Aritzia and I wear these all the time and I'm really comfortable with these and I think that they just pair so nicely with different items and you can create a whole bunch of different looks with just these pants. So I'll bring these trousers. I'm going to also bring my Levi's. This is just kind of like a mid-wash. These are the ribcage straight ankle and these are also really versatile and there's so many different ways you can wear these as well. They are a little bit more casual but you can kind of dress them up in different ways and I'll show you some of the outfits that I, I think I will create with these as well. The last pair of pants is these camel coloured trousers so they're a really wide leg trouser and this is from Camilla and Mark and I really like these they're very structured they're very kind of like a statement piece but at the same time very wearable as well so I really like these and I think they'll be perfect for the event that I'm going to so those are my three tops and bottoms that I've chosen and I've kind of changed around the 333 method just to suit me a little bit depending on where I'm going and what I think we'll be doing for the trip. So so for one of the outfits I really wanted to wear one of my new blazers that you've probably seen in my previous video. So this one is from Target, the preview section and I love the way it fits and I think it's really kind of, it's nice to dress up an outfit but at the same time I did get it in a bigger size than my normal size. And this kind of creates a little bit more of an oversized fit, but at the same time still structured. And I think this will be really good with maybe the jeans or any of the trousers. And I think it would suit any of the outfits that I want to bring. The next jacket that I really want to bring as well, I think it will be really good during nighttime dinner or when we're traveling. If I want to kind of pair it with a sweater or when I don't want to wear the blazer. Is this little tweed style cropped jacket. 
it's just got button details and it kind of is a little bit of a statement piece but I think I'll be able to wear this with pretty much any of the items that I want to bring and I really like this jacket I've had it for quite some time it's from a brand called Chic and this just creates a little bit of an interest to an outfit that might be a little bit boring so I'm going to bring this as well and then for kind of the travel days as well as if I need something a little bit warmer I will also bring this navy sweater this one is also from Uniqlo and it's just really comfy and cozy and it is made out of wool so it will keep me quite warm aside from jewelry the only other accessory that I'm bringing is this belt so it's just a black belt and it's got this little gold buckle detail so for my shoes I've decided to bring these black boots so I know that these are really comfortable I'm able to walk in them and I think this will be really good for the days that I kind of want to dress up the outfit without wearing something too casual they're just a simple black leather boot and they've got a zip on this side they're kind of like a square toe and a low block heel that's just got a brown kind of wood detail and I feel like these will be really good for yeah just when I want to kind of dress up the outfit maybe with the blazer the jeans or anything like that and they're really comfortable so I'm able to actually walk around with these and still feel quite comfortable so I'm gonna bring these the second pair of shoes that I really want to bring is my white Supergus so these sneakers are fairly new and I have worn them quite a bit and they're pretty comfortable so far I know that I can walk in them in a decent amount and I can also wear them with the trousers and the jeans and it pretty much will go with any outfit so these are pretty safe and they're also good for if I'm in the hotel and I kind of want to walk around for breakfast or go for a walk outside I can still wear these without having to bring kind of like a sport shoe so I'm really happy with these and definitely going to be bringing these as well that's all the items that I kind of want to bring and I think everything will work really well together when I'm traveling when I'm there for dinner breakfast and things like that and I probably won't need to do too many outfit changes because I will be working for the three days anyway so it's mainly the three days plus a little variation for the dinners So for my lipstick, I'm going to do the Chanel 434 Mademoiselle. It's kind of this, kind of like a nude mauve color.